because against the length of Orlando, when you get in the paint, you got a shot fake. You have to get them in the air, and, you know, Eric with the rare travel there, but it's difficult, difficult ways to score in there against their length. 16. See how effective Kevin Porter Jr. is tonight. Again, he's been a, a bit under the weather. Going around first, we should good. Then it was Jabari. Now it's KPJ, and he's able to make his first shot of the game. The Rockets have now made three of those to start. And listen, the Rockets are, are playing excellent right here in the game, and it's just moving the basketball, making oh. them have to guard you. That was good movement, both with the ball, and especially that cut by Bakker. Bakker does. He, he's an active, live body, and he plays really, really hard. Green around a double pick. Now working on Wendell Carter, their center, has a step. And a walk, another one. So we, we saw this how many times the other night at Minnesota? Six, seven times, both ways at least. I almost want to say double digit. Yeah, we've yeah. Seen a, we've seen a couple of walks already called here in the first. It's a real point of change. It, you know what? To start the season, there's always points of emphasis. And it looks like something that the league, the last two or three games, has really cracked down on. And players are so smart, Craig, they'll adjust. You won't keep seeing it. Wagner! And that's not going to count because shit good was set. It was outside of the restricted circle and took the charge as Wagner was trying to put him on a poster. He did, and he, he paid for it. Look at Al P here get outside and that left arm and <laughs> looked like a train wreck. And Al P is a brave man for stepping in on that charge. Goodness. Take one for the team, Craig. And that's important that Al Pete doesn't pick up an early foul also. They leave Gordon open, and he makes his second three. The Rockets are hot from three as they were the other night up in Minnesota. Now four of seven from downtown. Their lead is five. Yeah, indecision there from Orlando. They're trying to switch everything and just got caught up. And the Magic only shooting 31% from three as a team. So again, they have great length, tremendous size. But the shooting could be better. And I imagine it probably will get better once they get some more of their guards back and healthy. But, man, they've had a lot of injuries there. As Smith from the corner, he ends up missing his first shot of the game. And that should also lead us to our first timeout of this one in Orlando. Eric Gordon, a veteran amongst a lot of young guys out there, knocks down a three. He's made two of them already.